Hey guys, welcome to another Gaging Gadgets Phoenix 6 tutorial video. In this video, I'll be showing you how to upload audio files to your Phoenix 6. So these can be things from like music MP3s or audiobooks, podcasts. Doing this will enable you to be able to listen to music directly from your watch rather than having to listen to it from your phone or something like that. Now, if you're interested in using Spotify or Amazon Music, check the description because I do plan on doing tutorials on that in the future. I also have a tutorial on how to connect your watch to a pair of headphones. So check the description for that. So let's go ahead and get started. The only way to actually upload audio files to your Phoenix 6 is going to be using your computer. This can be either a Windows 10 computer or Mac, and you have to download the Garmin Express app. So I'll go over to my computer now and we'll get started with that. All right, so the first thing we need to do once we're on our computer is simply go to garmin.com slash express and check the description. I'll have all of the links down there as well as the detailed write-up in case you get lost. So once we're at garmin.com slash express, if you're on a Windows computer, simply select Download for Windows. And if you're on a Mac, select Download for Mac. I'm going to select Download for Windows. Go ahead and save the application on your computer. The size of the file is only 82 megabytes, so not too big. Now simply just go through the steps to install Garmin Express on your computer. And once it's done installing, just launch Garmin Express. And now with Garmin Express open, what we need to do is connect our Phoenix 6 to our PC. So we do that with our charging cable. Simply plug the charging cable into the back of your Phoenix 6 and then plug the USB side into your computer. Once you have your Phoenix 6 connected to your computer, simply go up and select add a device. It'll look for it and it should find your Phoenix 6 right here. Select add device. And now all you need to do is sign into your account. Once your Phoenix 6 is set up and it's showing connected with a little green icon right there, you might have some updates available. I'm going to do that later just because that might take a little bit of time. But all we need to do to add music to our Phoenix 6 is simply select music. Once we're in music, select the folder with the plus symbol on it. As you can see, it gives us a bunch of file formats that it's compatible with. That means that the Phoenix 6 can play all of these different types of files. In the folder directory below, simply find the folders that contain the music that you want to upload to your Phoenix 6. Once you find the folder, just check it like that and then select save. Now it's gonna analyze that folder. If you don't have any playlists in the folder, you can view the music by simply going to artist, albums, songs. You can select individual songs to upload. And I do wanna point out that I'm actually uploading not only music files, I'm also doing a podcast and then audiobooks. And you can see that actually differentiated down here in the folder. So podcast is showing the episode of Joe Rogan that I'm uploading, but for some reason it's not finding my audiobook. I can find that here in the artist section under George Orwell for 1984. Now what we need to do is select all the audio files we want to upload. Once you've selected all of them, go down to the bottom and select send to device. Now it's going to send 54 files to my computer. One thing to note at the bottom of Garmin Express, it's kind of giving you an idea of how much storage space you have on your Phoenix 6. So while they do advertise 2,000 songs can be uploaded to your Phoenix 6, it's really dependent on the size of the files. So just something to think about and keep an eye on when you're uploading audio. And while this is uploading, I just want to say that if you want to upload podcasts, usually most podcasts will be free. You can download them online because they have advertisements in them. So simply go to the website associated with that podcast. All right, it says we're done, transfer complete, select OK. And now when we go down to Phoenix 6 Sapphire, we can see all the different audio files we have on our Phoenix 6. Now, if you want to remove any of them, all you need to do is check that and then go to remove from device right there. And that'll delete it from your device and open up more room for other audio files. Once you're done, you can simply just close out the Garmin Express app and then disconnect your Phoenix 6 from your computer. Now, after we've uploaded the audio files to our Phoenix 6, all we need to do is open up the menu by holding the up button, then finding music, select that using the start or stop button, and now select music providers. Go up and select my music. This will play any music located on the Phoenix 6. And then we can go in here and we can see what songs are available all the way down to podcast which is pretty cool. Once you've changed the music provider to the music on the watch, you can easily get to the music by simply going to the widget. And then with the music widget open, you can change the song or anything like that by simply pressing the up button and then selecting the little music symbol to go to my music. And then in here you can go through and select playlist or albums, specific songs, or even podcast. And then as you can see, I currently have music playing directly from my Phoenix six to my Bluetooth headphones. 
So that's how you upload audio files to your Phoenix 6. If you have any questions about this, leave a comment below. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. If you'd like to see more Phoenix 6 tutorial videos, check the links in the description. If this video helped you, give it a thumbs up and please consider subscribing to my channel, Gaging Gadgets, more gadget reviews and tech tutorials. Thank you so much for watching.